The anticipation builds as Samsung prepares to roll out its first public beta update of One UI 7.0 powered by Android 15 for the Galaxy S24 lineup. User's wait may soon end. The first beta firmware for the Galaxy S24 Ultra was initially spotted in India and Europe. Now, it has also been identified via Taran Vats on Samsung's servers across all eligible markets except for one. The list of confirmed markets includes the US, UK, Germany, Poland, India, and Korea. While there's no sign of availability in China yet, it's reasonable to expect that it won't be long before it joins the list. Since the debut of One UI 1.0, Samsung has consistently limited its beta programs to these seven countries, allowing users to test One UI updates before the global rollout. It's unlikely the company will deviate from this pattern for the Android 15-based One UI 7.0 beta. Historically, Samsung launches beta programs in phases, starting with Germany, Korea, and the US, followed by other markets in the second phase a few weeks later. However, this year, there's hope that Samsung might break tradition and release the beta simultaneously across all eligible markets to compensate for the delayed rollout of One UI 7.0. Once the second phase begins, Samsung is expected to add more devices to the beta program. Most flagship Galaxy phones launched in 2023 and 2024 are likely to be included. If you own one of these devices, you'll need to register for the Samsung Members app, which is already set up for the beta program. Before we dive in, let me share an amazing Black Friday deal. You can now save up to $1,000 on the Galaxy S24 Ultra. Get up to $750 in trade and credit toward the Galaxy S24 Ultra or enjoy up to $250 off even without a trade-in. And there's more. Link is in description box. The beta program is designed to provide early access to software still in development. Typically, smartphone manufacturers conduct beta testing activities for their latest software skins. The goal is to allow users to test new features while they are still being developed voluntarily. Naturally, beta builds come with functional issues and bugs, and it's speculated that Samsung's One UI 7 may face a buggy launch. Its universe suggests that the initial version of One UI 7 beta might have some bugs, However, this isn't unusual since beta firmware exists solely for testing purposes. Galaxy users shouldn't be overly concerned as Samsung plans to begin the public rollout by early 2025. The tipster mentions that the most recent One UI 7 beta build carries the version number ZXKB. This build reportedly has animation-related bugs that surface during the final testing phase. Importantly, the beta program has not yet officially started for any Samsung device. Previously, the One UI 6 beta faced numerous animation and system fluency issues, which took Samsung roughly two months to fix. However, this time, the situation is expected to improve thanks to thorough pre-release testing being conducted in Samsung's labs. It's now mid-November and the Galaxy S25 series is rumored to debut in late January. During the Galaxy Unpacked event, Samsung will officially unveil One UI 7. Following that, Galaxy users will start receiving the update. Samsung's Android 15 update may introduce extensive customization options. Users could adjust the placement of quick settings panel sections based on personal preferences. The positions of the brightness slider and volume bar could also be customized. Goodlock is expected to receive upgraded modules and plugins. The Home Up module is rumored to feature an animation tuning option. Through Goodlock, Galaxy users could apply animations inspired by iOS or stock Android. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comments section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.